The 21st of October 2015 is an important date in the history of time travel because that is when Marty McFly goes back to the future in Doc Brown's Flying DeLorean. Now we may not have flying cars or self-drying jackets yet, but hoverboards, they are very real. Companies like Hendo and Lexus have made some impressive prototypes which utilise magnets and quantum levitation. And if you haven't seen quantum levitation before, then check out this mind-blowing video from our friends over at the Royal Institution. But what if you wanted to make your own hoverboard at home? Well, to make a miniature one, all you'll need is an old CD, a sports bottle top, plasticine and a balloon. Stick a ring of plasticine around the hole in the centre of the CD and push the bottle cap on top, making a tight seal. Inflate the balloon and place it over the closed bottle top. We've added a customised hoverboard design to our CD. Check the video description to download a free template. Now you're ready to hover! Place the CD on a flat surface, pull the bottle cap open and give it a little push. As the balloon deflates, it creates a cushion of air below the CD. The CD then floats on top of this air, hovering above the surface. Because our mini hoverboard is gliding on a layer of air, there's no friction between it and the floor, meaning it can travel much further. I wonder, could we make this big enough to ride? take our hovercraft out on the road. Roads? Where we're going, we don't need roads. If you've enjoyed this video, hit the like button, share it around and click on my mini hoverboard to subscribe. Check the video description for a link to download the hoverboard template. And if we've inspired you to try some science at home, send us your pictures or videos on our Facebook or Twitter. Thanks for watching. It creates a cushion of air below the CD. Ah, oh, what? <laughs>